Hello YouTube, back again. This is Omicron 4, uh, continuing our Final Fantasy V 4 job fiesta run. Got Mystic Knights uh, and Blue Mage, and we are totally kicking butt so far. So, uh, we are already, I believe, got 99 potions. Um, Phoenix down A1, and uh, we're good. So, let's go to the steamship. Werewolves and fire, and it's awesome. Can't you just like turn the key off? Tell me, a smart guy like you couldn't design a better ship. Like, what if there's a fire? Like, I mean, like a bad fire, fire that you don't want. Oh, like right now. How would you do an emergency shutoff? Hubris of Sid. Apparently, we get flash blue magic from the crew dust and something else from something that appears after a fight, maybe, if I can use bolt on it. It's real glove. Boy, that was kind of a waste of money, buying that. Let's see how tough we are. Dust. I'm gonna hope that Lena gets hit by Flash. I think everybody got hit by Flash. Okay. She definitely got hit by that one. And I hope we don't stay blind. Of course we do, because this is an old ass video game. Sweet. I didn't even notice if I got the blue magic. We did. Alright, good. Um, how many eye drops do I have? Two. In other words, not enough. I don't have much money. But I'm gonna have to go get some eye drops. I'm not dealing with this. This is dumb. I was talking about earlier, a lot of these old games really feel like they're kind of just. They have so many tedious elements that are sort of just designed to waste your time. Um. Like, you know, the eye drops are going to be super cheap. It's going to be a trivial matter to get them. Um. But it's just a time waster having to come back and, and do it. And get the items, blah blah blah, you know. So that's why I think a lot of modern games don't, um, don't even bother with that stuff. And after the battle's over, you're fine. Well, I'm here, might as well. Uh, is there I can sell? Oh, we can sell this. Might as well. I watch we'll probably never need him again for the rest of the game. And if I were smart, I would have uh, saved up some money to use the inn. As it is. Power, I wonder what that does. So maiden kiss. If that power like uh, drink raise attack power. Oh, it's like an ability thing. Probably 
just for combat or something. Now the bullshit is going to be when we wake up and we're still blind. Moment of truth. Okay, good. I was about to lose my shit. If I'd still been blinded there. Save again. Now that we're ready for real this time. What do these guys want? Yeah, these guys are just sort of expecting me to do this. Like they threw me in jail a minute ago. You're the guys who. You're, you're soldiers. You, you kill shit for a living, right? You're sending this team of kids in? Of course, I guess we did reveal that we had the power of the crystal. That's probably why. And it's kind of not the point, I guess. It's kind of funny, though, how games like this don't necessarily hold up. Story-wise, or like dialogue-wise, when you come at them as an older person. Let me tell you, when I was like ten or twelve, this would have been like high literature, man. Still awesome. The fact that Galif's uh, HP is constantly ticking down now for some reason. But I've found, as I've gotten older, that the thing I really appreciate about games is the gameplay and the spectacle. More than just, like, plot points, but how they're shown in, like, a really exciting way or something. interactive, there's like a uh, feeling of, at least for me, um, excitement and spectacle that you can't really match in any other form of media. But the trade-off to that is that, story-wise, it's probably the weakest medium. This ship did not look like it had all this much stuff inside of it from the outside. It just looked like a little... Like, river boat or something. <laughs> it had a little casino on board. Feeder. Feeder? I just met her. Either way, she's a mystic knight now. I don't think anyone's going to be defeating her. Okay. This is the thing that I heard you use a uh, bolt on it, um, it retaliates with explosion or something.
but uh, it looks like <laughs> I might just totally defeat it. Oh, uh, why did I do that? Hmm. Hmm, a quandary. I think we're gonna have to move whoever's doing the attacking to the back row. They do just a teeny tiny amount of damage. I guess. So we don't kill that thing in one hit. Kind of a good problem to have though. Just doing so much damage. Like too much damage. There was certainly a time in the game when that wasn't the case for me. Continue on, and if those guys show up again, great. If not, we will save at some point, I'm assuming, and hit it then. very elaborate on the inside. I'm not going to make the obvious Doctor Who reference. Yeah, if you guys could just hit, that'd be great. That'd be great. Magic Sword. What? Okay. What? Is there anything over here? Probably not. Feeling lucky this time that those robot dudes will show up. We'll move the person into the back. Oh my gosh. Oh boy. Note to self, kill those first. But at least we got our eye drops. We are prepared. We're good little boy scouts. Girl scouts. I feel like Exploder would be a really good skill to have. I hope I can get it. Oh my goodness, this, oh no. So that was the first one. It just takes me back there. Okay. I was commenting to uh, my friend when he was playing this that it's kind of sadistic to have a dungeon with puzzles and stuff like this uh, and also have random battles. go that way, but it's a one-way. Oh, okay. 
Yeah, it's kind of sadistic to have random battles in a dungeon with, like, puzzles and stuff you have to do. Kind of makes it a chore. And by kind of, I mean it really makes it a chore. Okay, so that's that. Uh, let's try number three. I hope I hadn't done that one already. Ah! Leaf glove. Be sure uh, not to use that. Uh, I think I came that way, didn't I? Still need to check the fourth tunnel there. And the middle door, I think. Huh, got some choices here. Ah, well that answers that question. So, get back to where we once belonged here. Is it the third door? Yes, but I can't get in there that way. Great. See what I mean about the tedium? I don't mind tedium when it's, you know, fun, but it's just kind of a pain. I guess this is the way. I don't even know. gotten into any random battles? I made that comment about random battles, but it doesn't seem like we've actually had any. Ordinarily, I'd be fine with that, but I kind of want to uh, fight that exploder again. Okay, is it the middle one? I don't remember. genuinely do enjoy these old Final Fantasy games, but I really gotta say that series and games in general have come a long way. And apparently I just turned on my uh, phone with my voice. That's odd. Is it number two? Gosh, I don't know. Save and never go back in that room ever again, please. Thank you. Here we 
go. Preemptive attack, that's what we like to see. Sing even when we're not blinded. show up. I wonder if there's like a, a way to make him show up. Oh my gosh, Sid, did you have to design it like a dick? Oi. Ooh, there we go. Alright. Um, no, I don't unequip it. There. This is Gallop. I'm gonna do regular bolt. This even works. Yeah, Blue Mage is dead, that's good. I'm thinking Mystic Knight's probably a better deal than whatever else I was doing, so let me just check real quick. Oh, well, it looks like it's kind of terrible anyway. Cast Doom on the caster, but it does damage equivalent to the amount of HP that they have left, so it's not, like, awesome. I guess you could use it in, like, kind of a Hail Mary situation just to nuke the boss, but, eh. Okay, now this super fun puzzle here. I can't do anything with that. Alright, kill that first. But, why? What does he. Hell if I. Tell you 
crack is some bad shit. Oh, hey, look who it is. My friends. Guess what, friends? I have something I think you'll hate. Suck it. You get one-shotted, and you get one-shotted! Everybody gets one-shotted! Hey, I gained some levels, that's good. Oh my gosh, this is so much fun. I'm gonna have to be on that one, I guess. Paris just knocked yourself out of confusion. If you find yourself confused, just hit yourself. And everything will be made clear. She even gained level out of the experience. Okay, that's what I wanted to see. Now we're gonna stand on this one. Hopefully. Yes, good. What do you want, piss ant? <coughs> I think these guys are showing up all the time now that I don't want them to. Like a sonic sound effect. Sonic! Si oh. My. Goodness. That is the opposite of worth it. That is the polar opposite of worth it. That sounds like boss area to me. Um... That out of the way. That up. At least they move pretty fast. So, did you ever consider just? Why did I do that? Did you ever consider just building a series of catwalks? No. Shoot. You know, like catwalks that just are attached all the way across. So you don't have to, like, solve a puzzle every time you want to go to the bathroom from the engine room. Because to me, I mean, I'm just, you know, I'm not, not an engineer or anything, but to me, that sounds like the way to go. finest. We'll come up with an elaborate scheme of levers and switches and platforms that move. And that'll be great. It'll allow people to go from place to place. And you could have just built a bridge. Who it is? Explosioners. Motor trap. Now is it a motor that's a trap? Or is it a trap for motors?
Here they come! Did you notice how after I ascertained that I couldn't make them do the blue magic sk skill I wanted to learn from them, that now they're appearing in like almost every battle? Funny how that works, isn't it? Funny. Funny. Alright. Um, anything neat here? Hey, I found the queen. Now, what do you want to bet? I have to kill the queen. pipes here. Let's go ahead and use some potions. Kind of a waste, but whatever. We got plenty. I think we're getting to the point where they're a little too weak to be super useful in combat, which might actually end up being a problem, but let's see if we can nuke this chick real quick. sweet looking engine. It's like some kind of thing from like an 80s anime that's just pulsing. An old time revival. You're gonna be born again up in this bitch. Your engine's a little hot there. Let's go with um, Ice 2. Would that work? Ice 2. This Lena can be on healing duty. She survives. She survives. Yeah, potions don't really do it anymore. What? How are you gonna miss? How are you gonna miss? Maybe you always miss on the hand. Yes, you do. Uh, how about arrow? Oh, it heals it. That's no good. Can I frog it? Fingertips. Ew. Goblin punch. Yeah, decent damage. Doesn't look too good for our heroes. Although it is healing itself, so. Ay, ay, ay! So apparently, you can only hit it when it's uh, in man form. We'll have to use Goblin Punch the rest of the time. Oh yeah, baby. Oh, it doesn't like that at all. Alright, alright. Give me some of that. When it's in hand form, it seems to really hate vampire. When it's in man form, it seems to really hate ice. 
Oh! What is your problem? So I guess it does do a ridiculous amount of damage, so... Too. So vampire when he's like that. Let's see if we can get a hit in. No. Alright, I think I got it though. So everybody ice. Everybody ice. And you can, when he's a man. When he's anything else. Vampire. Okay. Oh, yeah. Good. I wanted that to happen. deal with all the missing. I really don't get that. Maybe we're just lower level or something, or some of, one of our stats is too low. I don't know. A lot of missing in this game, though. It sucks when, if all those attacks I had been trying to hit the boss with had actually hit, uh, he would have just been nuked. Like, he'd have been done. I was doing like 600 pop. But now I think we know how to heal and heal and deal, baby. Heal and deal. I should, be, I should come up with an official strategy for the four job fiesta. Talk about how the first thing you have to identify with your job set is how you're going to heal and deal. Because really, that's the crux of any Final Fantasy. Alright. Let's do it. Alright, rev that bitch up. Come on. Revival! just like nuking us now like he wasn't doing that before but now yeah yeah nice oh it actually hit yeah I guess you just gotta be lucky which kinda sucks but I think I know how to do this, and you might not like it, but I don't care, because I'm kind of tired of this. Uh, I am going to turn off active time battle, because I'm sick of it. Uh, yes. The reason being is that 
the way my jobs and stuff are, I have to do so much dinking around with the menu, and nothing is in like an intuitive place, and unlike some later Final Fantasies, it doesn't seem like you can arrange your stuff to get at it better, so I think it's just kind of crazy. And it's just, you know, you're just giving yourself more damage than you need to be taking. Um, so, that's what we're going to do. And nowhere in the uh, rules does it say you, you can't turn it off active time, so that's what we're going to do. And I probably could, like, just grind up a whole bunch and it not be an issue, but that's just a pain in the butt. Like, why not just turn it down and not have to grind? I mean, you still have to make the same decisions, it's just not about how fast you can navigate a menu. So anyway, that's my excuse. That's what I'm doing. And Dark Clave started doing it, so, uh... So, it's fair that I should do it too. Okay. Alright. I was thinking about putting him in the back, but it wouldn't really make a difference with the magic. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Now we can just take our time and, and do it right. I feel like this is better because I'm not just rushing through, I'm actually kind of savoring the experience of thinking about it, you know? We'll have her do vampire all the time. Only, it only pauses it once you're actually looking for stuff, so you still have to kind of decide if you're going to fight or use magic pretty quick. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to hang with him if he just keeps trying to do that. It feels like a boss where, like, he can really screw you up. <laughs> He has the ability to just, like, spam cast whatever he wants. Um, he can just take you out if he wants, so it's kind of just like you're, you're praying to RN Jesus that um, he won't do that thing that kills you. Let's see if we can... Ah, if we could just hit him, you know? Off. Now they're back on. Good. Excellent. I didn't want to move anyway. Alright, dick.
Finally! Does that mean you can't do flame too? That would be awesome. Huh, of, of course that's not what that means. <laughs> what was I thinking? I guess when he's in this form, I should heal everybody. Or try to. What? How did he suddenly get. It's like he decided he has MP now. I guess each form has its own bank of MP. Alright, hit him. Ah! Yes, finally. I feel like every single battle I'm just kind of scraping by on some mechanic. Like, why couldn't my whole team have stayed up, you know? How was Galif so special? He just survived the early nuke attempt by the boss that took out everybody else. And he was able to hold on by a hair. That's my excuse. But first... Alright, jump cut there. We are back. We are back. Alright. Let's see. Phoenix down on these people. Just in case. I don't care if it's a waste. I don't want to get yanked. Especially after just Making it through by the skin of my teeth there. Can I just go save, actually? Glad Sid at least had the uh, foresight to make sure his little puzzle here could be solved. Backwards and forwards in case you needed to come back from the steam room. Until you go to select something. Yeah, you know, the active time thing. It really just buys you time in the menu when you're going through your magic or items. It doesn't, um, doesn't actually pause the whole game. Which kind of makes a lot more sense, I think. Because there's just so much magic and stuff you have to go through in this game, and it's just a hassle. Electromagnetic, I just realized that says electromagnetic, not electro. Okay, let's uh save. Save the new slide. What the heck?
Of course. At least it's a preemptive attack. We get rid of this crew dust first, or else it's gonna blind everybody. Sick baseline. Oh, shut up. Alright. There we go. At least we're getting some decent experience and stuff here. Yep. All right. Good place for you. Fire crystal. Uh-oh. It's the cleric beast. thing. <laughs> oh, sorry. Fwa ha 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 ha. Fwa ha 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 ha. Only we'd had the foresight to have like redundant mechanisms to shut down things in an emergency. I don't think Sid's as smart as everybody thinks he is. Gotta run! Gotta 
Castle Karnak explodes in 10 minutes. Next week on Final Fantasy V. Well, at least they have the uh, decency to give me a save point. Mighty Christian of them. Oh, we're running now. Oh, we're actually motivated now, okay. Oh, nice. I think I need to go back this way. Yeah, that's where I was. Looks like they fixed the cell, though. What are all these prisoners doing with foot lockers? Monster in a box! Alright there, buddy. Now I wonder if I can get any good um, magic here. That is Arrow that he's using. Let's see here. Um. Um, Arrow 2, Skyrim, Skyrim, and Arrow 2, and Cornet Castle. Give everybody the learn ability. in a box and it'd be that guy again. Oh, good. Alright, we need to do arrow two. Come on. Not elbow. Definitely not built for speed. Alright, whatever. Let's go. I already came from there. I don't really care about anything else now. We just crappy items that I don't really need. Can't use or something. Is this the way out? I don't even know. It's your seat action. All right, Sergeant. Crap, you stubborn. Once a sorcerer. Oh, hey, we're the same, buddy. We're sorcerers too. Oh, really? All right, no more chests. This is dumb. They're all gonna be like monsters. Uh oh, 
Music's getting faster. Ether, that would be nice. Eh, alright, fine. Free! Oh, man! Quick, take him. Kick their ass! Kids, hurry up! Castle's on fire. Castle's always been on fire, but th this guy's—he's not just a sergeant. Show your true colors! Do ha 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 ha! Bounty hunter, iron claw, change form. Well. Some bolt two. Maybe some ice two. Maybe even some fire two. One of these is gonna hit you hard. Not that one though. Or that one. I'm totally gonna die, aren't I? Got any blue magic that'll work on him? Arrow two, maybe. Suck it. Ah, I wish it didn't like stop them as well. It's fine if you want to take my HP, but don't. You know. All right, good. Sweet, I learned skill. these be? I think it's their power? They've never done that before. How weird. Mediator? Geomancer? Ninja? And... Oh, that's it. There's actually, like, a couple more that you get later or something. I don't know. What I do know is that there is no more castle there. Holy crap. They weren't kidding. A thug blew up. Let's see. This night to recover health. What's the difference between a cabin and a tent? I don't know. Safe. Apparently that death claw thing is totally missable. Uh, so it's good that I got it. Excellent. Excellent stuff. Uh, let's see here. Well, I am going to um, I'm going to save. I'm going to save again because I'm crazy. <clears throat> I'm going to cut the video here. And uh, look forward next time to when I reveal what our new job is. Uh, I'm excited. Really excited. Um, hopefully I get something that can really round out the party. So, 
thank you for joining me. Please consider donating to Child's Play Charity. Um, that's the whole purpose of this Final Fantasy V four job fiesta thing. The link is below in the description. Thank you for coming on this journey with me. And this has been Omicron 4. See you next time.